How's it going guys? Doug Game PC here. Welcome back to the channel. Now on today's daily scrim video, I have another mod for you. This is one of my favorite types, the house mods. This mod adds a player home called Drift World. Right here. So we are going and it becomes undiscovered yet. It is an undiscovered marker on your map. So I mean that means it's on your map, you can find it. But you just can't fast travel to it yet. It's not like discovered. So we're going to go and discover it today and look through it. Let's see what it has to offer. So I put a nice little place marker where it is. So let's get on it. Alright, so here we are. Just arrived at the house. So let's check this thing out. Alright, so it looks like we got a nice smithing area with a smelter. An enchanting laboratory. A book. We have a nice little patio back here for more of our smithing stuff. We have some crafting supplies. We have a nice little garden. We have a little fishing area. And a boat. This looks like the main entrance with another chest here. It doesn't say empty, but it is. What the? Okay, we're just gonna pretend that never happened. There's a key! What? This is gonna be a pain. Um Oh my god. We're freaking glitching so much right now, bug. Let's find where this key is. Did not see in the description that there was supposed to be a key. So let's find out where this key actually is located. This thing ever loads. Okay. To enter, walk directly forward from the front door to you toward the lantern. Look directly forward the lantern. You'll see a rock under a large tree. Then you'll find Lafa. Having met her. I. We gotta kill this thing first, though. You know what? Fuck it. 
So, from the front door. Turn around. And, okay, you're really getting, you know what? God, you're fucking annoying. Annoying piece of cow shit. Alright. So immediately at the front door. Turn around. Walk straight till you find a lantern. Okay. Here's a rock. There's supposed to be somebody here. Oh, it must be over here. For a rock under tree. Mm -hmm. Let's keep looking around here. This for oh. All right, so the person we're supposed to find is you know. Well, that's a lot of help. She's dead. Ah, right, there's the key. Okay. Well, that's depressing. Anyways, get back to the house. <clears throat> there we go. Heading inside the house, let's see what we got. Can we just fucking move out? Alright, so we got some display cases. Emily Axe in one of them. Mannequins. Yes, a shelf with some food, a fire pit, and a cooking station. Another display case and a dining table. Nice little study kind of room. Some books. Little alchemy laboratory to make some cool stuff. A bookshelf and up the stairs. We have the main bedroom. Nice electric chest with some gold. A wardrobe. Some more chests. Nice little chair to sit and read some of your books. A display case that holds a dagger. and beneath sword over under a bear head so a nice starter player home i wouldn't use this home compared to vogan estate or the dovican keep which i have also done videos on and if you guys want to see those videos check out the rest of my channel and you will find them but this is a nice beginner player home a nice little quiet area just to live with that one girl who is well for me dead because you couldn't handle two freaking frost troll or frostbite striders, which is kind of embarrassing. If you die by those two little things, you're a pretty weak of a character. But she did look like a nice woman to live with, other than having, you know, a purple face. Nice little rack, though. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you did like it, hit the like button. And be sure to download this mod and also Vulgan Escape estate along with the Dovican keep peace out guys thank you for watching subscribe